I believe I was not preaching today. I was addressing you. Yeah. Who went to the mountain this week? Uh, this Friday. Who went to the mountain? Can the, somebody go mark? The first group of people that went to prayer mountain on Friday. Please, let's see your hands. Okay, please, Mike. Mike, you go to the... Start to the... Yes. Stand up. They say, what do I do there? What do I do there? Stand up. What do I do at the prayer mountain? You are staying at the private room. No, 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 no. Oh. That walk, we're touching that walk. They say I do it when? Every time. Every time I'm there. Once I get there, that's how I walk. We have almost 400 meter walkway. When I do one, two, it's one kilometer. I do three, four, it's two kilometers. I do this, it's three. So every day I do three kilometers. Inside the walk, it's a walkway, prayer walkway. While I'm doing that, I'm meditating before I go and sit down and open Bible. Bible is a holy book. You can't just take a holy book like that, begin to page as if like you are reading a, a magazine, a boner, a, 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 no. It's a holy word. I clear myself. I move. I just move. 400 meters. 400 meter, 400 meter, 1.2 kilometer, 400 meter, this. By the time I finish rounding there, I have walked three kilometers before I start to pray. And I move. They did it. We move. We did it. In the night, in the day, I walk around there. I meditate. I walk. I talk to God at this. I clear the path by meditation. I clear the path. I move this. Three kilometers every day. I'm, that's all. I walk around. I walk around. I walk around, I walk around, clearing, clearing, clearing. When you pray without meditation, I only listening to me. When you pray without first meditating, you are like a man, a woman that is smelling for the past three months about this. Do you understand what I'm talking about? So I clear. I can't just open my mouth to God like, just like that. I need to check if there's anything wrong I have missed. Any pain in my heart. Before I even touch this book, I will walk that way. Clear, clear everything. Clear, 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 clear. Sometimes I would do, four, do like that, it's four, three kilometers, I would do four kilometers, five kilometers. By the time sometimes I finish, my body is, is otherwise. I go and lie down. This body, I've dealt with it. I've punished it. I open my Bible there. I read. When I read there, it's like I'm sucking honey when you are hungry. Manchua awela. I feel it in my belly that the scriptures are soaking. I'm soaking into the scriptures. By the time I open my mouth, oh my God, there's nothing that beats that kind of joy. So what is good for me is good for you. Things we learn from great prophet of God. We are now sharing with you, we create such environment. Blessed memory, thank you for the life of Prophet T.B. Joshua. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. So what, I, what is good for me is good for you, is good for you. What I know, I want to share with you. What is working for me, I tell you. This is what I do this. They walk there. Almost 400 meters, you move. As a prayer walk, move. Meditating, meditation, meditation, clear the path, confession. You confess, oh Lord, whatever. Hey, this. You clear. Clear the path, clear. Cleanse yourself. Oh Lord, in the name of Jesus, the blood. You keep changing one word from there. You worship, you worship. You worship, you sing to Him, you adore Him, and everything. You, yes, and everything. By the time you finish this, you, even when you are tired, there are places where you sit down there. Oh, where is, let's hear. Another one, where is this, my people? I say, these children have started again. Come, Mama, stand here. Okay, can you? The, the other experience, men of God, that we had, we were told that as we were working around, we must be able to listen to the birds. And the experience happened 
the, the instruction was, as we are listening to the birds, they will not talk, but they will make a humming in a song. As I was working, I listened to two of them. They said a humming in hallelujah. I'm listening to that. I'm listening to that. You are failing to worship God. Birds are worshiping him. There is a bird that comes there. It just takes any word from a worship and it, it turns it into a melody. And you say, Hallelujah. Say, hey, hey, hey. When the song says, Eze, the bird will be saying, Eze, in the same way, Eze, Eze mean king. It's an Afri, one of the African language. Any song that plays there, look at nature. It enhances spirituality. God is God of nature. You don't worship him, birds are worshiping him. You don't meditate, birds will meditate on him. Will adore him. This is our experience. This is not our birds. They are just there because of the trees around. They are not my birds. But they recognize the presence in that place. If, if we can show you videos of what is happening there, we have allowed guests to be going there, you'll see. I'm not there. you see when people enter some of the prayer places, they, they just vomit. No mass prayer, nothing. We record everything there. We have. If they do have any outstanding team, please play for them. I think today is it's an address today. We just want people to get themselves. They've been playing ATM Christianity, limiting God. Daily limit, monthly limit, when God has abundant blessing. Let's say one or two people that are really vomiting there to say, I'm not there. You share their experience. So why will this birds will not go there that are created by God to be in an environment like that? They begin to listen to worship some playing there and they begin to repeat the song. By making melody, not like a parrot, melody. They come there. Where have you heard that? You can only hear this when you spend time with God of nature. You are busy in the town, busy everywhere. Hey, look at how you are going to die. You die here, nothing, knowing nothing, everything, zero about you. Not knowing the one you're supposed to go back to while you are here. The name Jesus is not going to be used in heaven. You need to use it here to protect yourself, to guide yourself. The Bible says we have been given power to, for everything we need to live on. on okay, first, second Peter 1, 3, we've read. In, in, in heaven, there's no issues. Issues are on earth. Marriage issues, career issues, business issues, family issues are here. Health issues, spiritual issues are here. Hallelujah. Amen. Hey. Ah, people, so I believe you are somewhere now, your understanding is somewhere now. Amen. You are not going to do what you have been doing. You just open your mouth. Just like that. Just take the Bible to open read. Just like that. You are a dangerous man. You prepare yourself. That's a holy book. Even to open your mouth to God, you clear yourself, you cleanse yourself, your heart. You can't talk to God with bitterness, anger, hatred. You just want to open your mouth to talk. You can't just live anyhow, you are there. When trouble comes, you want to access here. Overnight, over a minute, one hour of kidnapping, you will not see it. They will finish you. If they rape you, they will rape you. If they cut your hand, who will cut your hand while you are. But if you get used to this life, it makes it easy. You will not panic. Even if it takes you one hour to get there, when they, you are used to this life, God, you do the, oh my God, help will be on the way. If not, God will prepare you in advance to say, you know, you, you always take one hour to get to me. Tomorrow is trouble. Please make sure you are in the spirit. 
because this one hour of you getting there, to, it will not work for you. These three hours of getting close to you, you will not work. He will uh, inform you when? In time. She said, trouble is coming. The follow, you now know, hey, I have to be in. Hallelujah. So there's no video, nothing. Okay, let us rise up. Thank you. They did not prepare it. We are sorry. Your presence is heaven to me, oh Jesus. Your presence is heaven. 